Local middle school is encouraging students to get creative by letting them paint the walls. Our Nikel Delgado visited Winnebago Middle School. Nikel, how did all this come about? Mimi, I'm told Winnebago Middle School wants the students to feel like the school is their own space. And what better way than leaving their mark with some special artwork for generations to come? There's a couple other murals in other buildings, and I felt kind of sad when the middle school building didn't have any. This is Beth Melanson's fifth year teaching art at Winnebago Middle School. She wants kids to want to come to school and have fun, so she challenged the art club to put a splash of color on the blank white walls, an idea that came from one of the custodians. She had mentioned, she's like, oh, these, pit, these walls are so white and so bare. You could do a Bago W right here. And I was like, that's amazing. I'm going to make that happen. Beth tells me her students didn't believe her at first, but they were happy to put their mark on the school in a good way. Eighth grade student Mason Meekum says she's happy others will be able to see her passion for art. I got really excited because I did my own bedroom, like I painted everything and I did like the same thing as we're doing the confetti mural. Principal at Winnebago Middle School, Dan Phelps, says they strive to provide a positive place for students, so allowing them to do this was a no-brainer. School doesn't belong to the teachers or the administration, the school belongs to the students. And so a, a way for them to make it their own, to put their mark on it, is pretty crucial. Our school's like really creative and everything, so I'm glad our school can let kids show their art skills and not just do it on like for grades or just paper and let other people come into the school and like see everyone's work. Beth is excited to see these murals come to life and hopes the idea of art will inspire the younger generation of students. Like seeing it on paper and the sketches we've done, it's, it's interesting, but then actually seeing it on the wall and students being like, it's so cool, when do I get to do that? And Winnebago Middle School tells me the art won't just stop in the halls. They plan on having murals painted in the gym and the locker rooms. Mimi? Looks good. All right, thanks, Nikel.